Closing time. It's the light at the end of the tunnel. The last hurrah. Time to wrap this up. But before you can make this sale official and receive your proceeds, there are still a few items that need to be addressed. Stay with me as I give an overview of what to expect in the days leading up to closing day. Hi, I'm Chris Delano with the Old Mill Group, a local real estate agency here in the Raleigh, Durham and surrounding areas. Thank you for tuning in today. It is no secret that getting to the closing table requires a team effort. Let's lay out what you need to know to have a successful closing day. If you have your closing statements from the purchase of your property, please refer to it to find the name of the title company. The closing attorney will be asking for this information. If you don't have it, that's okay if it is unknown. If you do have the information, it's helpful on the title search step of the process to have a place to begin with. Decide if you are going to want your proceeds distributed to you via check or wiring if the closing attorney allows a choice. Remember, although the attorney will distribute the funds day of close, receipt of funds that have been wired is not necessarily instant and can take up to 24 to 48 hours depending on your financial institution. Please leave all utilities on and keep your homeowner's insurance in place. Please schedule utilities to be disconnected for the day after closing. That way, if there's a hiccup in the closing date, you'll still be good to go. Once the deed has been recorded, we will notify you so that you may cancel your homeowner's insurance. It is vital to keep this in place until the buyer's ownership is officially granted. If your property is governed by an HOA, please reach out to the HOA company to inquire if there are any possible current HOA violations. Once the account is clear of violations, please obtain a letter and forward it to your agent or the closing attorney. Additionally, please be aware that any open or expired permits will need to be closed prior to the closing. Start packing now. Plan on having the property cleared and spotless 48 hours prior to closing day so that you'll be ready for the buyer's final walkthrough. Typically, buyers schedule these 24 hours prior to the closing date. All of your personal items, cleaning supplies, garbage, and debris must be removed from the property prior to close. You should be fully moved out at this point. As a courtesy, after all that purging, packing, and moving, you may want to do one more deep cleaning. Leave owner's manuals and warranties. Selling a home should not be an adversarial transaction. It would be very kind of you to provide all manuals and warranties you have for the home's appliances. Placing documents in one place for the new owner will be extremely helpful. If you have receipts from contractors for repairs or installations of systems, leave them with the manuals. If you have been in your home for any length of time, perhaps you can provide a list of your favorite vendors that have worked on your home. Provide the new residents with contact information for trusted contractors or maintenance companies that you've done business with. The new owner will appreciate having a list of servicers they can trust to continue the care of their new home. And lastly, upon departing for the final time, be sure to leave all the keys and garage door openers in a kitchen drawer. If there is a key associated with a mailbox number, please ensure the mailbox number is written with the key. I spent nearly an hour one time trying the key in every single mailbox till I found the right one. Neighbors were looking at me like I'm trying to steal their mail. It was not fun. And it won't be fun for the new buyer either. Well, that's it. Soon your home will be officially sold. Selling your home is a progression of steps. With careful planning and working with your agent, you can be sure you will have a successful settlement and settle into your new phase of life. For more information on selling your home, be sure to check out our other videos. If you would like to be notified of new content, be sure to click our logo to subscribe. Thanks for watching.